Much can be and has been learned about robotics from the natural world. Robots based on biological species have a wide range of useful uses, and much can be learned about evolution and the forces of nature that produce such extremely complex designs. Nature also plays an important part in robotics. Yes, robotics can and have learned much from the nature. With the important knowledge of nature, robotics can unlock many evolutionary puzzles that have been just a riddle over the years. Today, we are presenting some of the most advanced robotic animals that are real and magnificent. Welcome to Zone Tech. In this video, we are going to talk about the robot animals you won't believe actually exist. So before starting, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for future updates. Bionic Ants Ants are well recognized for their work ethics and unity, so why should ant robots be any different? Besto, a German automation company, launched bionic ants with the goal of not only replicating the delicate anatomy of the natural ant, but also bringing the cooperative, one-of-a-kind behavior of insects to the world of technology. To plan their actions and movements, they will be able to communicate with one another. The Bionic Bird Even though it's just a toy, the bionic bird not only looks like a bird, but can also fly like one. The bionic bird, which can be operated with a smartphone, was created by a French company. It has a range of 100 meters and a top speed of 20 kilometers per hour. Its creators have long dreamed of a bird that is powered by electricity, but this dream could only come true with the development of light microtechnology. And now the bionic bird, which weighs only 9 gram, is a fascinating alternative to the customary propeller drones. Animal In 2009, engineers at the Robotic Systems Lab of the ETH Zurich started to develop a four-legged robot that can move autonomously and is intended for use in harsh conditions. Animal is now able to run, climb hills, and even operate the elevator. The robot constantly builds a map of its surroundings using laser sensors and cameras keeps track of its location and carefully negotiates the terrain. Animal weights about 30 kilograms, has a payload capacity of up to 10 kilograms, and has a two-hour operating time on a single battery charge. The ETA spin-off Antibiotics is in charge of its distribution and future development. Robotic Sea Snake Deep sea operations are expensive and also very risky for people. The present-day instruments and automatic underwater vehicles that perform deep-sea tasks are bulky, slow with low maneuverability, and extremely expensive. Robots, on the other hand, are ideal for the job, particularly when they can imitate a real-life sea animal. Elu worked with engineers from Kongsberg Maritime, Statoil, and other Norway-based companies to create the first snake robot ever. Robo-bees Bees play a crucial role in our life. It is said that they are responsible for one out of every three bits of food that we eat. According to the U.S. Department of Agriculture, roughly 35% of the world's food crops and about three-quarters of the world's flowering plants depend on different insects to pollinate them and bees are the most important of them. However, the recent decline in their population has brought up some significant issues in the agricultural sectors in many regions of the world. A Japanese research team began the first steps in 2014 toward creating robo-bees, robotic bees that could aid in pollinating seeds in flowers and fruits. Although the technology has a lot of limitations and needs a lot of development before it is ready for the market. Spot Mini Boston Dynamics, a subsidiary firm of Alphabet Incorporation, is a well-known figure in the robotics industry. The business has produced numerous frontline robots throughout the years for both military and civilian use. One of their most recent creations, the Spot Me, is a diminutive four-legged robot that can live happily with us in our homes or offices. Spot Mini can assimilate into your work and home environments easily. It also has a strong power backup. According to various test results, this machine can run for more than an hour on a single charge. Important tools including stereo cameras, position sensors, and an IOU or inertial measurement unit are part of the sensor suite. They can assist you with daily tasks, especially for old people. The Bionic Kangaroo Kangaroos have extraordinary stamina because of the way the tendon in their legs works like springs to recover some energy before recycling it into the next jump. 
By actually creating a kangaroo, German engineering company Festo took a practical approach to illustrate how this idea may be applied to machines. The prototype is gesture-controlled, using a commercially available, sensor-laden armband of the type that can be used to control drones. There is no indication of whether these will be made available to the general public just because they are entertaining to have around. Muddy Bot After years of intense studies, scientists have come to conclusion that earliest land animals had certain tail that helped them with crawling. To test the findings, scientists at the Georgia Institute of Technology, along with other institutes, initiated a study. They created a robot they called Muddy Bot to do it effectively. They were able to better comprehend how early animals emerged from the sea and adapted to land thanks to the Muddy Bot, which was inspired by the African mudskipper. The data, according to the experts, suggests that the first animals to migrate from the ocean to the land most likely had tails they may have moved more efficiently thanks to a powerful tail. The Cockroach Bot UC Berkeley biomechanist Robert Fole has spent years studying the movements of animals and their potential applications toward robotics. Fole was intrigued by how cockroaches, which have a hard shell, can fit into almost any area. He looked into it and discovered that roaches have a special way of moving. After that, they applied what they had learned to create a robotic roach. The Roboroach is part of an emerging field of soft robotics, which uses pliable materials like polymers in place of metal and hard circuit boards. Rubbirds. Nuisance birds can cause all kinds of problems in any particular area, and there has been no permanent solution for that. Birds frequently stay put after they've chosen a place they like. They put everyone in danger by disrupting busy flight pathways, causing excessive agricultural damage, and spreading illness they were able to drastically lower insect activity by up to 70% after many live tests. The rowbird can also be used to single out and chase away particularly stubborn birds. While they are currently controlled wirelessly by an operator on the ground, an autonomous version is currently in development. Cheetah The cheetah from Boston Dynamics is capable of approximately 30 kilometers per hour. Its entire stability, which distinguishes it as a superior bot, is computer controlled. With regard to the hips and body, the computer modifies the position of each foot, as well as how far forward it should contact the ground with each step. The Cyborg Stingray Kevin Kit Parker, a Harvard researcher along with other university researchers, introduced the idea of taking apart a rat's heart and putting it into a tissue-engineered stingray, which first came to his mind during a trip to the New England Aquarium. And it was something extraordinary. Research of this magnitude can lead us to a significant advancement in newer generations of robots. So that's it for today. What do you think of our video? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video and would like to hear more from us, please subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications before you go. Thank you for watching.